Let's look at blending with the palette knife. What I'm going to do is take some paint, some black paint. This is oil paint. And close to each other, I'm going to place these two colors right next to each other just to give an example of blending with the palette knife. All right, I've used, I've used this one for making the paint go out like that. I'm going to use this one for blending them together. It's because I can get this one flat and we're going to be going in circles like this. All right, so this is blending with the palette knife. You're not going to get smooth blends, so you can just write that one off. I mean, you, you can a little bit if you work with it. So I'm going back and forth here, and that's going to give me a better tone. And this is a graduation from dark to light. And it is aesthetically pleasing. But it's not going to be super realistic. But maybe that's not the point with palette knife. That is all there is to it. There's literally nothing to even say about it, honestly. I mean, that happened in seconds. There's no complicated techniques. There's, there's really nothing to, nothing to share, nothing to report. All you have to do is get your paint out, get your palette knife, put some paint on a surface, and experiment and practice with the palette knife. It's so not technical. I've been painting for years and that can make things seem overly simplified for me because a lot of these things are just automatic or <clears throat> I've just done it for so long that I don't doubt myself, I don't question myself and I just do it. But you have the same ability. All you have to do is just go try it and do it. 